If I'm the boss and my workers pull this garbage, this is what I do. I start garnishing wages. Mm. And then I start docking vacation days. Good. And then you know what I do? What? I get my private security guards to go over to her house on a Thursday afternoon at 3 o'clock to see what she's up to. Nah. Maybe I find her at the mall. Mm. Maybe she's at TGI Fridays throwing back cocktails. Maybe I have footage of her trying on blouses at Ann Taylor. Maybe I'm in her closet. Maybe I'm trying on her clothes and staring at her through the closet slats. Maybe I'm collecting her hair up off the ground. You're a creep, dude. How did you say any of that without a moment of self-reflection of how disturbing that sounded? It was grotesque. As long as we're talking about how creepy Jesse Waters is, I would be remiss if I didn't remind everybody on how he met his wife. Waters said that he once let the air out of now wife Emma Digio Vine's tires when he was trying to get her to date him. Literally, that sounds like a plot from It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. This is like the level of just like horrific monstrousness that exists within like your average political right winger.